Every Wednesday morning, a group of guys gather at Black Rock's brewery, mount their fat bikes, and ride. Where they ride two changes from week to week, but the goal is simple. Drink coffee and welcome the day. It's been a weekly event for some time and originally started with just a couple of riders. We were sitting around at the, the sports track thinking about things to do on Wednesday mornings and uh, you know we decided that a Black Rocks coffee ride would be a really good idea so we started doing that and yeah it's cold but it's also fun. We're all just a big group of friends and we like drinking coffee so we figured it's a lot better to drink coffee outside so we just decided to get on our bikes and come out and ride to a cool spot around Marquette and drink coffee every Wednesday morning and it took off. We've been doing it every week and uh, we're planning on doing it all year round. It's just a great way to start the morning. You're so cool. I am cool. I'm really cool. While conditions aren't always ideal for extended play outside, it's hard to beat good times with good friends. Well, we get a pretty good group out here and it's, uh, it's a good time, you know. You get to wake up in the morning and pedal around this beautiful countryside that we live in and see some sights and pedal some bikes and wake up before work it's it's a good thing it's a good time i don't know about you but i just like to get out go for a ride you know Have yeah some coffee it's a good way to wake up every day best way to wake up go out for a little rip get a little uh coffee and you know hang out with friends beautiful views beautiful people you got these yahoos in the background it's just great yeah the winter a lot of people and you want it's easy to sleep in but it's, yeah it's nice when you get up go no for such it. thing as bad weather just bad clothing and bad attitudes and bad coffee and of course, it wouldn't be a proper coffee ride if there weren't a long pour or two. So we call it a long pour. The idea is to get 90% or more of the coffee from the thermos into your drinking vessel. There's a fine line between perfectly aerated coffee and too cold coffee. If you get it to the optimal height, you create perfect crema. Just like that. I would call that about 80%, not quite 90 or percent or higher, but pretty good. Anyone with a love for riding bikes and coffee can join the wild ride, which leaves the pub at 8 a.m. or shortly thereafter.